Hello everyone, this is Vita Safe 32 back with another deck review. Today we're looking at this deck. It is the Van Swoon, as it is pronounced. Um, if I'm pronouncing it correctly. And there's going to be a lot of Vietnamese names that I am absolutely going to butcher, so I apologize in advance. This is designed by Lin Tran Do on Kickstarter, produced by USBC, with an Ericus and Finnis, and I believe just a bicycle stock. They didn't specify that, and it's inspired by historical Vietnamese figures. The front says, uh, The Land of Eternal Spring, Van Swoon, Vietnamese playing card, the Phoenix within the pip, one of the holy beasts, focus size, 54 playing cards on one side, Vietnamese cultural figures on the other, some artwork on top, We'll add copy on the bottom and check out the website lintrandoe.com in the back is the back design and you get a nice foil seal with some symbols just a standard USB-C tuck case more symbols on the flaps um then you get a little ad card with the social media links go check those out it's a limited edition I don't know how many were produced, I assume like 2,500. They see the back design, which has all sorts of symbols within it, nice red and white. Um, it is based on the Dong Son drums, the back design. And I believe there's more information, uh, where is, oh yes, here. Also included with this deck, <laughs> which I threw in the box, is this little pamphlet, basically, booklet, with information on everything. So I will be using that. And it actually says here the back design based on the bronze drums from the Dong Son culture of ancient Vietnam, approximately 1000 BC to 100 AD. They often depict images of animals, people, and geometric designs, which you get all of those within there. <laughs> then you get a little ad card, which could be a gas card at the front of the box, basically on there. Bit of a thick border, but it's, you know, it's not bad. The Jokers, uh, first of all you get this guy who has a bad hairline, <laughs> this kid, uh, let's see if I can find the information, yeah. oh yes, there it is, he's a um, folktale character named Fang Bum, aka Boy with Dangs, and apparently boneless. <laughs> And uh, known for living a simple and unmaterialistic life, materialistic life, needing nothing to be, nothing more than a fan to be content. This is the Vietnamese Cinderella, known as Tam, from the story Tam and Cam, Tam Cam. Uh, yeah, Vietnamese equivalent of Cinderella. If we go to the aces, they feature the holy beasts. The ace of spades has the dragon, aka Long. Um, usually represents the Emperor. The Ace of Hearts has a Phoenix or Fung, which represent good fortunes. Clubs, these clubs here is the uh, Golden Turtle or Kim Ki, hopefully, <laughs> and it basically represents scholars scholars which is what the clubs represent and the diamonds representing the warriors has the unicorn lion or key lan which is known to bring good luck and it, like i said it's the warrior suit diamonds is the warrior suit this is the scholar suit the hearts is the representing the last dynasty in vietnam it's the modern courts cards the modern suit and the spade is the uh, ancient suit representing the first dynasty in Vietnam and as such you get that with the court cards as well here we have as I'm gonna put their names Lac Long Quan he had a hundred children good lord <laughs> I, I don't believe that <laughs> Queen of Spades is Ao So his wife and Jack of Spades is Fu Dong Fian Wong. Apparently, at the age of three, transformed from a mute child into a giant warrior. Okay. <laughs> the King of Hearts is Nguyen Phuc Vinh Tui, 
also known as Emperor Bao Dai, the last monarch of Vietnam. The Queen of Hearts is Nam Phung, last Empress of Vietnam. I'm not going to go into more details that the Queen of uh, Jack of Hearts sorry, is Crown Prince Bao Long, the eldest son. Going on to the clubs. Flip my page over. Come on. <laughs> You've got the uh, Nguyen Tri, a Confucian scholar, uh, scholar, an advisor to an emperor. Queen is a poet, Nguyen Thi Hin, whose pen name is Ba Huen Fan Quan. Interesting. And the Jack is Li Kui Don. A savant, prolific savant. Interesting. And then going on to the diamonds, lastly, you got this dude, Ningu Viong Quien, who is a hero who ended a thousand years of Chinese rule at the Battle of Bok Dong River and established Vietnamese independence, founding of a dynasty. This one is based on the Trung sisters of Trung Trak and Trung Ni. And Apparently they rose up and reigned for three years before being defeated after that thousand year war or during the thousand year rule of Chinese uh, thousand years of Chinese rule my apologies and Jack of Diamond is based on the hero Trang, uh, Tran Hung Dao apparently he repelled Mongol invaders interesting and yeah it's nice little book with lots of information which was a stretch goal as was the gold seal on the deck and the number cards nice customized pips really cool well done and yeah very nice deck beautiful artwork really custom um nice bicycle stock ericus and finis and if you want to know more i recommend checking out the project for more information on everyone there was also an alternative uh, version that came with a, a tin case same cards it just came that it came in a tin case overall i'll give this a solid a plus really nice or maybe an a yeah i'll give it an a well i don't know a a plus <laughs> i'm kind of i'm kind of torn between that because obviously it's a nice deck tuck case obviously they didn't do too much with it but the cards are really nice and then the back design it's nice but it's kind of simple but it all works and it all fits so you know pretty cool and that is that comment subscribe let me know what you think and we'll see you next time for more thanks for watching